Welcome to Flex Rental Solutions demonstration of our web-based integration with Production Exchange. The scenario that we want to present to you today is one where you are the inventory manager and it is your job every day to update your classified ad displaying all the inventory items that you have available to re-rent to your customers. This task alone could take you half the day to accomplish. With our tight integration with Production Exchange, you can now do this seamlessly and effortlessly without any daily interaction. Here we are on Production Exchange's website. We're searching under high-end consoles and we're looking for these consoles from the 30th of March to the 6th of April. We can see all of our competitors have their inventory availability up there and we need to change that to make sure our potential clients see our availability also. To do this, we're gonna to go to our version of Flex and we're gonna to go to System Settings, Production Exchange, and these are all the settings that we've received from Production Exchange so that we can upload our inventory availability to their website. With these settings in place, we can go below and test our connection to Production Exchange. And here we can tell that the connection was successful. So now we're gonna go and update the models with the information that they need to push their availability up to Production Exchange. We're gonna to go to our Grand MA Lighting Console there is now a new tab for integration, and I can just start to type Grand MA2, and it'll automatically bring me all those, and I'm gonna select the top lighting console and hit update. Next, let's go to our full bore lighting console, and this time I'm gonna click the binoculars to do a little bit more robust search and type in full bore, and again, we are searching live to their database for what their E codes are. We're gonna select that and update that. Now, with that done, we can go back to our production exchange module and we can resend our availability and hit close. And now we can look at our integration bus and see that we have a queue waiting to go out to production exchange. This will take us a couple of minutes to send our, all of our availability up to them. After we refresh, we can see that our queue is down to zero. And from here, we can go to the Production Exchange website. And now let's look at the Grand MA lighting consoles. And now on Production Exchange, we can see that Flex Rental Solutions has three Grand MA lighting two consoles available from March 30th through April 6th. Now, if we go to the high-end systems lighting consoles, we can see that Flex Rental Solutions has one Roadhog full bore available during the same time period. Now we're gonna go back to the Flex side and set up a new quote and add those same consoles and then recheck our availability on the production exchange site. We're gonna add a full bore lighting console to this quote. We're not gonna use any of the suggested items. And now we're also gonna add a Grand MA2. You'll notice that the ship date for this quote is April 4th and the return date is scheduled for April 6th, which will create conflicts on the Production Exchange site. After pushing our new availability up to Production Exchange, we can go and look at the Grand MA and refresh the site. And now we see we have two available during that same time period. And now with no full bores available during this rental period, our listing has been removed. I hope we've demonstrated how easily we can integrate with Production Exchange. The whole goal of this process is to drive more re-rents towards your company and to maximize utilization for your on-hand inventory. If you have any questions regarding our integration with Production Exchange or any other Flex Rental Solutions questions, please contact me at chris at flexrentalsolutions.com.